the uh, op nows first after the EMM-1 burn. Can you see from the 180 degree end of the asteroid? Um, you do the best job you can telling the thrusters exactly where you want it to go. There we go. And let me zoom in just a bit. Okay, so this is the simulation of the shape model. We're looking at a very interesting area on the asteroid where we see, you know, lots of evidence for the regolith and uh, infilling of craters. And it looks like we're really on course for the descent of the surface later on this afternoon. Imagery data. The initial timing adjustment was based on Doppler tracking from the Deep Space Network, comparing the actual Doppler shift achieved from the maneuver to the expected. Now I'm going to take you up to the present time, if I can see the next view graph. Uh, in this view graph, you see there's the orbit of the Earth, and then there's the orbit of Eros, and you see that Eros uh, stays outside the orbit of the Earth. This is good, and where we want to be getting images, and we also want to be breaking it. And that is shown in the next view graph, which shows our descent profile. And you see this takes about 47 minutes if all these braking burns work properly. This final descent looks like. And here's the spacecraft coming down to the asteroid. The thrusters are firing, and it's slowing down nicely. And you see the solar panels are pointed to the sun. The high gain antenna is pointed towards the Earth, so we're getting high telemetry rates back at all the time. Uh, here we're doing a little turn to reorient so that the right thrusters are firing at the proper times. And this shows uh, the very end of that descent where we're coming down about 500 meters above the surface, slowly coming in. And uh, I guess I only hope that the landing is as good as it looks on this film. Very slight bounce. I think it might be a little bit uh, harder than this in actuality. This is the first time that any spacecraft has landed on a small body. <laughs> All right. Congratulations. We get lucky. The highest resolution image is right on it. And down here, we see in the bottom, you, you, the, the mess that you see it here is missing enough velocity to have survived the, uh, survived the touchdown. So uh, this is going to play out probably for some time here this afternoon uh, as we continue to track the signal and see if we